What is up guys welcome back to another video and inside of today's video we are going to be going over my top picks for the maps so um this is going to be part one of the two that I'm gonna make but you know these contests um are going to repeat like somewhat frequently so I may just cut it down to one per week only like some like the day before the submissions end, I'm going to review all of the maps and I'm going to be giving out my top picks. But yeah, without further ado, let's hop right into my top picks for the first two days of the submissions. And for another info, um, Mordius said that he decided which maps will be the winners. He and uh, the death team will already have already picked the winners, but we do not know them yet, and they will tell us when they're allowed. So yeah, probably during the sneak peeks. Um, I'm really excited to find out. Like, it's probably going to be like either um, probably next week, and there will be no qualifiers this round, which is you know a bit unfortunate because. Um, some people actually do like qualifiers here, so yeah. As I said, we are going to be going through over the first two days of qualifiers, because there are quite a few that I actually picked. Okay, so this first one by Sirmo Savi, Pixel Paradise. Um, I'm pretty sure, no, uh, there's, there was like someone who spelled pixel wrong, but I don't think it was him. I think it was another guy. Okay, but for this one, I really do like the concept of um, having walls near the... Having walls and grass like this um, structure near the gem mine. And I just like, you know some of the concepts in general but the block variety isn't very very like um very great um things can still be improved but overall i like um where he's going this one by iro sundial okay so this one i really i really kind of like um jump pad placement because it brings him to like um somewhere where you normally wouldn't be on and honestly i really just like um the aggro side so this left side and the things that i don't really um like these um one by two blocks near the gem mine it restricts the movement somewhat um big and yeah this one by biohazard pixel yeah that's the guy who spelled pixel wrong pixel with a y no it's pixel with an i okay so the reason why i chose this map is because um first of all the lanes they're actually um pretty decent lanes i really like the little curve to the blocks and um i i also like that um there's like an entrance to aggro brawlers or like sharpshooters and i really like you know you can make a lot of opportunities out of that and yeah this one by akos yt dirty factory first of all i don't think it's that dirty because um it doesn't compare as dirty to other maps but anyways puns off um this map has like like this chain ring to it that's what i would call like um these structures so block after grass after block after grass this is what i call chain structures and the um the creator used this really well um really impressed by um his skills and honestly um for siege i want to avoid ripoffs of like three lanes in siege i want like more originality and also i'm looking for like um walls in front of the eye this way it gives an incentive to break walls use wall breakers to um 
shorten the path of the robot okay this one by Dima gaming energy wires and okay so also another um chain structures as i would call it but this one's um has less chain structures around the mid but the grass it's way longer and the structures are just overall um way longer and yeah honestly great use of um block variety but you know could be used better but um this is like by far the best um block <laughs> block variety that i've seen and yeah cloudy dash point now for the people that got maps in game i judged them a little bit harsher but anyways um i like the finger okay finger um block structures so basically fingers that you got these two <laughs> Um, you got these two um, blocks right there and then you got like another set of blocks that are let's say um, longer than the two blocks like fingers um, that's um, how, how I call these structures it's kind of weird but um, you'll get used to it and I kind of like these um, square no rectangle shaped blocks there are walls in front of the Ike and Overall, pathing is really good, and the mid isn't, you know, very wide, because bolts usually spawn near the mid, and yeah. This one by AJ Mechanical Mayhem. Okay, first of all, um, the map seems a little bit messy at first glance, but, um, then you got, like, these, um, structures near the mid, which makes up for like um re really good gameplay i don't think that the one by one um tree is necessary like it it blocks some um, missiles but it shouldn't be a big deal and i just like that if you want to switch lanes you gotta take a bigger route and yeah um i guess the eye carrier can be improved and you normally don't really want to place that much grass in the eye because it only serves for aesthetics and um, maybe for like gadgets or star power uses but other than that you don't really want grass here. This one by Clumsy River Shootout. Okay so this one I don't know about the gameplay but I guess the idea behind this is really good because you got two by two blocks separating each body of water and honestly um i really <laughs> it sounds it looks weird but i just really like the idea the general idea like the gameplay might not be that good but at least um clumsy had um a really uh, good idea not really executed that well to be honest but um yeah just uh, some sort of honorable mention okay historia citadel of night this one kind of stands out to me in the way that the middle it's somewhat um open but it's somewhat closed and also they're like um those structures near the mid they're, they're like good spawns uh good placements for turrets and for the sides like here the sides are really well used and it's a great balance between you know good um good and good structures and grass and yeah so i mean the structures aren't like that original there's like finger walls you know but um otherwise you know it's pretty cool i really like the map this one by strawberry god cakewalk and okay this map seems a bit messy but um no i kind of like that um he played a bit with those 
fences and like it's kind of like you know warped arena but and gem grab kind of like the vibes here but and also um he also used this um chain chain blocks so so um block after grass so that he also used that um strat it's not a strategy it's like a technique and yeah overall map just feels pretty original it that is what gives its look this one by Rai Riz Rai Rise Rice what well, however you pronounce it fertilized factory okay so first of all the IT area it incentivizes you to use um a wall breaker cause you know for the buck to walk around that um these walls he needs to take a lot of damage and by the time he gets up to the eye he's probably like already al almost dead if not already dead and the middle it's not really the best middle but you know he, he kept it really clean and you know the sides they're a bit questionable like how this top right side is really good for penny turrets you, you you don't really want to see you know that many penny turrets here okay so q16 d bot riot okay so first of all i, I wouldn't say these are like finger structures but they kind of look like fingers they, they kind of look like actually you know they kind of look like finger structures to be honest but um I guess you could say but first of all block variety isn't really that great so he could improve on that but otherwise um the blocks are really used the space it's fairly used fairly distributed evenly and yeah no big flaws on this map just like you know this um the block variety isn't that amazing so we are on our um okay. how can i say this okay jupe gas station okay this map what what is standing out to me is that the middle it's um there are like two different structures separated by water and um some fences fencing and the other s section it's separated by some tires as you can call as you can call them and yeah that is basically the main structure but you know i guess the creator could use you know a bit more um creativity on the sides like here you, you know you can get on the sides and yeah this one the final map because um didn't want to make this like a 30 minute video um instead i'm probably gonna like get another video soon and talk about that uh, talk about other maps in another video and but this one by toxin lab short circuit and what really stand out stands out to me is the middle like the middle it's from your side to um almost the enemy side and you can just parkour around them here walk, walk around here and there's also good spots for like <laughs> there, there, there's really good spots for rosa gadgets which i don't really appreciate it because rosa rosa gadget is really useful but otherwise um I guess this map is okay, um, I don't really like, you know, the spawns and, you know, the block in front of the spawns, it kind of promotes, like, spawn, spawn trapping a bit, but, um, you know, I guess, um, you know, you, you could say more about the map, like, that, but, 
um that is going to be it for the map review this is like the fourth map review that i've made like f fourth or like so, okay, i lost count but um you could probably check them all and yeah that is going to be it for the video and i hope you enjoy it and leave a comment down below on which kind of maps you want me to like review i can review some of them in the comment section below or something but yeah that is going to be it for the video um thanks for watching and i'll see you next time peace out